All right. I got the microphone working. All it was is I had to plug it into the computer. But when you move 47 things that have to be plugged into the computer, pretty good chance you're going to miss one. So I think I'm finished moving everything. I got the new table built out in the new shop. Got the shelving units out there. It looks a whole lot better than it did. Well, I mean, it don't look better than it did, but it, there's more room. That was what I was wanting to accomplish. So we'll, we'll get out there and keep at it. And a lot of projects coming up next month, month of Dogtober. All the revenue from both channels will be donated to the local rescue. So I was just going over comments, and there's a section you have to uh, approve, you know, and you put in the cuss words and things you you want to flag. Uh, I don't flag a whole lot of stuff, but there was one in there, and not only did he or she, I don't know what it was, had to make bad stupidity comments to me, but was going after the people that had left comments, you know. And that's the world we live in today. These people that are that do this, that are all tough, you know, in the comment section. Yeah, they're the ones with the big old fat, thick glasses, the nerdy types. They're not they're not big muscular guys making threats like that. These are desk jockeys that, you know, desk bullies. I don't have time for people like that. I reported them and blocked them. But, you know, that's one thing. If, but then they went to everybody's comments. And, and, and that was not, it was on a podcast a few back, and it was not meant to be a, politi- a political post. Uh, and that's just a couple minutes where, where it became a little political. But, you know, it doesn't matter what side you're on politically. Everybody has a right to their own opinion. And you get those militant types. Oh, they're so mad because you're not on their side. No, but you look like a nutcase. Why would I want to be on your side? It doesn't matter what side you're on. If you got a side or you don't have a side, it doesn't matter. And so you get those quite a bit. And most of them you guys never see because I make sure you never see them. Or if I do see, if they do get past, you know, I, I don't mind if somebody criticizes or expresses their opinion. But when you got to call people names, and I never, ever even mentioned I had a political side. Okay, they're assuming things. They'd have no clue. I try to stay out of it. But you can't help it anymore. Every single news story is political. I mean, there's no, there's no news stories anymore that, that are non-political. And, and the more this circus gets going, you know, it's just fuel for the fire. So I try not to I check the headlines in the morning, pretty much it. Make sure we ain't blown ourselves up yet. Cause that's a real good possibility. You know, that Betelgeuse is about to explode. Yep. Betelgeuse. That's the name of that planet or that star system. Ain't even spelled like Beetlejuice. They don't know how to spell Beetlejuice right. They spelled it really weird. But it ain't. It doesn't look like Beetlejuice. You can't say that. I already said that, what, twice? I can't say it again. Especially with Clippy sitting behind me. He's right there. Oh, I don't like him behind me. I've got some pretty bad pictures of him doing some things that are questionable. And I don't like him behind me. And then I don't know his friend too well, the troll. They just sit there and look all day. It's what they do. Yeah, I'm going to have to relocate him to where he's in front of me. Maybe a shelf up there. I I don't know. So anyway, if you got comments, if you don't have any nice comments, you know, you can say this till you're blue in the face. People are still going to get on there and comment. Don't say nothing. Very few times do I have to get on somebody's video and comment. Now, comments, I'm not saying don't comment. Comments drive up the Alpo rhythm. So we want your comments. But they don't have to be hateful. 
and that's just part of YouTube. You know, there's a lot of hateful people on this earth, and that is, it seems like the amount of hateful people triples every year and gets worse and worse and worse. But if that person was in front of my face, would they act like that? I highly doubt it. Maybe they might, but I doubt it. You know, what you say online and what you could say to somebody's face for real, that's two different things. So a good rule of thumb, if you're not going to say it to somebody, if you can't say it to somebody's face, don't say it. Don't say it because you don't obviously really mean it. Uh, I don't know. It's crazy. It's a crazy world. That's why I like living rural, but now I do YouTube. So I put myself out there, which, you know, you're never going to hurt my feelings with comments. <laughs> you ain't going to embarrass me. You know, I've been called everything under the sun. You guys have seen those comments. Uh, you know, my chickens have been under threat. Yeah, there was a reward out there at one time anybody wanted to capture my chickens yeah so there's nothing new there but i just wanted to say that i i was not meaning to make something and it was the way i i, I accidentally said something uh about voting i says make sure when you vote you vote the right way i i meant to say you vote the right way the way that you feel you should vote. But I said, make sure you vote right. And then I'm thinking, wait a minute. Oh, now I know what they are yeah, now. I didn't say it that way. I said, make sure you, 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 you're making the right, you know, that you think you're making the right choice. I didn't say go out and vote right. I didn't say that. Lost a whole bunch of subscribers over that. So here we are. That's the end of that. But that's what I meant. And this will be the first time, the first year in a long time that I've went to vote because I think it matters. I ain't telling nobody nothing else, but it has been a while. I think the last election, it was in the early 2000s, you know. And, and then when you get older, that becomes more of a, an issue. When you're younger, you could care less what's going on. As long as your life's okay and you're eating, when you're younger, you don't care about politics that much but when you get older and those people that you put in office are affecting things that have something to do with your life, whether it be social security, VA, whatever it is, uh, then you got no right to complain if you don't vote. So I'm going to make sure I get out there. I don't even know. I, I signed up, I voted for registered to vote. And usually there's a church down about four miles down the road, and that's where everybody used to go to vote. And I'm, it's just for where it tells me to go to vote, it says MH. Well, where the hell's MH? I don't know where MH is. So I got to call the county and say, where's MH? Because I've never been to MH. And that's where I'm supposed to go vote. And that's got to be in town because there's nothing else. That church in town, that's the only thing in between town. Now, I think one year they voted at the church across the street from me. But other than that, that's the only two things on my road. But I got to go to MH. I don't know. What could that be? Uh, I have no idea. I don't know any. And why don't they spell it out? Are they, are they getting charged by the letter on their typewriters? So I'm going to make sure, and, and that's a nice thing about living where I do. I'm not going to have to worry about getting up early and getting in line. There won't be any lines. There's never any lines to get your driver's license. There's never any lines to do anything because there's just not many people here. And if there is a line, it'll go pretty quick. I don't even know how to vote. I mean, what? I don't even know what the machines are. I don't even remember the last time what what it was like i think it was an electronic screen i don't know i don't know what this county has everybody has different things uh i don't even know any of the local who's running locally or any of that i don't know just have to wait and see and uh and i know they elect the sheriff like every two years it gets 
Political signs never come down in this county. They're always up. Uh, it's like every time we turn around, we're get, getting a new uh, uh, county judge or sheriff. Never know. So I don't know. I don't think those are up this time, but we'll see. That's less than a month away, about a month away. So, but I just wanted to say yes, no. I didn't get, I didn't tell you to vote for one side or the other. I don't care who you vote for. You don't need, that's nobody else's business, but yours. Uh, just because, you know, I don't care what your political party is. That, that has no business on my channel. Uh, this, cause I'm not going to go into further discussions on politics on my channel. That only leads to trouble and I don't want that. I've got my opinions. You got your opinions. Uh, we just, uh, it's different times, different times today. And the things we see happening, <laughs> you just, they're unbelievable sometimes. I mean, they're just unbelievable. It's just like a battle. One side, and the other, you know, it's brewing is what I'm saying. All right. Well, I just want to get on here and, and, Double check my microphone, make sure everything is good. We'll get you back to whatever you was doing. Or you, if you're watching this, you were bored anyway. So we will see you tomorrow. Happy trails.